Oh, this looks just like the deer that I bought the other day. A fish. I have to get to the fish. <laughs> Aww. Look how sweet that is. Oh, he's a birdhouse. Oh, he's, he's adorable. Those look very, very Swedish. Wait, is it a Swedish duck? Look at that. I'm a thrift pimp. There you go. Where is she? She's in the hat kind of fits, you know, I'm just saying. I have not opened these doors for a while, but today is the day. Today's the day. It's all getting emptied. Woohoo! It's all going to the new store. Anybody need a lamp? <laughs> all right, so we're buying all of the the tables, displays, a little fitting room, bookshelves, tables, jewelry case cubby display, more shelves. We're buying all of this. We're buying all of it. Well, it is another beautiful day here in Las Vegas. A day just made for thrifting. So I am at some place I haven't been for a while and uh, apparently there's been some rumors flying about reasons why I haven't been here. So I just want to put those to rest right here, right now. We are at dog junkies. And no, am I alone? I am not alone. I, I am with somebody who knows dog junkies very well. <laughs> <laughs> so Rebecca and I are here to support dog junkies, show everybody that no, there are no hard feelings for Rebecca not working here anymore. For me, I, I just haven't gotten here. Okay guys. So, uh, if you have gone into dog junkies to stir up problems, and say that I have been telling people not to shop at Dog Junkies. You just stop that, because it is not true. And guys, remember, this only hurts the animals, and you know me, you guys know me, I'm an animal person, so please don't do that, please don't talk bad, because Diana that runs a home for Spot, she's an amazing lady. She saves 6,000 6, dogs a year, guys, 6,000. I didn't even know that number, 6,000 dogs 6, a year. 6,000 dogs a year, so guys, wow. please, you know, shop here. Yes. And I'll shop. Yes. And it's small business. You guys, all of us small business owners, we got to stick together. It's us against like the big giants, you know, in this world. So just all rumors put to rest right here, right, right now. So we're going into dog junkies and we're going to shop and we're going to support the doggies. All right. All right. Bye. Let's get shop done. What do we got out here? How about a whole bag of coloring books for four bucks? Oh, oh, that is, oh, it's plants versus zombies. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, they're all different. Are they all like new? They're all, Check this look at, they're all like brand new. That's a great, that's a great bargain. That is a very cool piece, Oh, guys. look at it, it's got birds on it. Someone needs to grab this, come down and get it. Where would I put that? <laughs> you know my house, where would I put that? By the fireplace? I could. I could put that by the fireplace. I kind of like it. It's very cool. I might. Okay, I might. That might be mine. Think about it. That could it be might spend. be mine. All right. Not going to spend too much time on clothes. All right. Let's get inside. Yeah, it's They say something on them. Kind of cool. What do they say? They say Italian brunch. Oh, they're signed on the bottom too. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. They're very high quality. Oh, God. oh, these are all broken. But I like that they got saved. Oh, wine holder. That's very cool. Ooh. That is signed. I can't make, oh, Stuben. These are Stuben for $30. That's an excellent price for a piece of Stuben glass. Oh, 
Oh, this looks just like the deer that I bought the other day that has the little baby with it. This one is $6 and I'm gonna get it because I think I'm gonna keep and, and decorate with these. So I'm gonna grab him to go with my other ones. Those are cute. Those are cute. Got this really heavy. Made in Italy. I don't know what that says. Hmm. I don't see a price on that. We may find out. Got some really nice things right inside the door. Let's see what we got up here. Lots and lots of glass. There is the Westmoreland grape pattern. This is interesting candle holder. Hmm. Pretty, little, pretty little teapot. Mitchell and Company. Oh, is Thor is Thor here? Oh, everybody's been asking about Thor. Look at this beautiful depression glass set. $15. So it's $15 for the centerpiece and the candle holders. I think we're going to go ahead and grab that. Let's see. These are Victoria from Czechoslovakia. Franciscan. So that's the newer of the Desert Rose pattern. These are oh, stuck key. I don't know if you can see there's a little etch on that and it is depression glass. Really, really pretty. That one, also really super pretty. It's got like a little, um, I, I, it's not daisy and button, it's just like a button hex pattern. See what these little guys are. They're not marked. Little dessert dishes. Oh, those are pretty. Little swirl glass. Probably made in Mexico. Oh, they've got something on them here. What does that say? It's got a crown and an anchor. I do not know who does those. We'll go around to the other side to see some of that other stuff. Let's see, these are interesting little salt and peppers made in Japan. Four dollars for that set. I think we will grab those. Those have been there for a minute. We might want to linens and things. That's really pretty. It's got an interesting swirled glaze, but there's no maker's mark though. They're kind of moving things around as we speak. I'm kind of keeping track of where they're going with things so they don't put something where I've already been and then I miss it. These are fun. Fun little black and white footed mm -hmm. mugs. Okay. Oh, those are cool. A fish. I have to get to the fish. Oh, he's a nutcracker. He's a nutcracker fish for six dollars. We'll take him. We got cooking stuff. All right, I'll get out of their way. They are trying to get their shelves all arranged and I'm kind of like reaching over them. I'm just going to get out of their way. Real misery really loves wine. <laughs> those are kind of funny. For two dollars I'm going to grab those. I love fun socks. Let's see what goodies we have. Gosh, lots of nice new in the box items. Dormeyer. I don't think I've ever heard of Dormeyer. 
It's, I mean, it's of the same era as like the mix masters and such. There's a lot of activity going on in here. Oh, look at this little vintage 1970s avocado green baby. I'm not exactly sure what it does, but it does something. Let's see. Who are you? You are Sunbeam. Avocado green. Oh, I see elephants. I see elephants. Somebody put that in. I don't see any damage to him. I don't see a price, yeah, but it's four bucks. He came. Oh, out of the he box. came out of the box. Perfect. We'll take the elephant for four bucks. Oh, it's a nice little set of etched wine glasses. Actually, is that wine or is that something else that you would put in a dainty I, yes, little guy I mean, like just that? Just the wine. Set. You put the wine. Okay, on the side. so it does have wine, mm -hmm. and then okay, yeah. all right, all right. Oh, we need some bathroom soap? We'll take it. Yep. <laughs> hey, those look really familiar right there. <laughs> and over. I just see all the little animals looking over, but I don't know who Andover is. Rebecca's looking at me. Put the mug down. She's, she's side-eyeing me right now the mugs <laughs> that's cool thermo serve thermo serve that's vintage i know that sunbeam piece i know i just don't know what it does what does it do does it brew tea or something oh it does it is okay all right look at this little teapot it's a teleflora this little guy, some birds on it. All right, ooh, little Cuisinart yellow knives. No, it would kill me, like, I have so many knives. Oh, but look, they're all different colors, and they're so pretty. This is my weakness. <laughs> Look at their brand new, all nice and sharp. He would be very happy that I brought home new, nice, sharp, nice. Oh, and then, vanilla? yeah, because then he could take the other ones over to his little casita, and then he could have knives in both places. That's true. See how I justify my purchases. Yeah. Those two do something like that. Oh, there's a silver tray. Let's see. Is this one? Yeah. What else? We got. Okay. Might be gone. Does it, is it oh, cold? look at this. Is This looks vintage. It's made in China, but it still looks like an older one. It's made of wood instead of like plastic like they make them now. Yeah, they're saying vintage. He's $10. Beat him for a collector. It's um frosty. Oh, these are interesting. Look at this. What's that material? It's um, made in Taiwan, Republic of China. So that can help you date it exactly. I think that's 70s. Looks, so. It looks very 70s. It's a tree topper. So $4 on that one. And then... I would imagine this one is also $4, so we're gonna grab those. Let's see, this pretty Christmas tree here is a hand painted in Italy for FB. That's nice. I'm still so not ready to think about Christmas. How about you? Yeah, it's coming up fast. It is coming up fast. I'm just not ready to think about it. I'll do what I do with everything else. I'll procrastinate to the last minute and then, like, oh, shoot! I gotta get ready. You don't need to look at these. Uh oh. Is it is it turtles or birds? Or horses? You know it's one of those. It's birds. <laughs> oh come on, you know those are coming with me. It's like five dollars for that one and five dollars for that one. <laughs> I think I'll get the flamingo to put in my live sale though, because people like flamingos. Oh, look at the little cactus. Yeah. I actually really like that little cactus. He 
is cute. I might, I might get him too. This is plastic. And the butterfly. See, I'd be in trouble if I didn't get the butterfly. Are all his little rhinestones there? They are. All right. Believe it or not, I'm going to leave the dolphins. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. All right. All right. Let's see who makes you. Specially made in China for the White Barn Candle Company. Nice quality. Aww. Look how sweet that is. I'm trying to see if it's... No, it's... It's Lord Unlimited 1978. That is adorable. We're going to leave it though at 20. That should go to a collector. Fleurs du Jardin. Jardin. Those are very pretty. Alright, let's look over here. I see some kitty cats. We have some very excited doggies in the back. He's $12. He is vintage, but he is spectacular. Um, now, if this was at Goodwill, I may not have paid $12 for it. Uh, but again, because this is supporting a cause, we know where the money is all going from this thrift store. I'm going to go ahead and pick this up for $12. These little guys are not quite as exciting to me. But Grumpy Cat, on the other hand. Grumpy Cat is $12. I almost had a chance to meet Grumpy Cat. They were they were doing a, a meet and greet and an autograph kind of a thing at a convention. And I had a chance to go meet him and I passed it by and then I think he passed away the very next year. So never got a chance to meet Grumpy Cat. But again, um, it's a gund? 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 Gund. However you say that. Is gund. it gund or goon? Gund. gund. Okay. Yeah, gund. gund. Um, we will we will go ahead and pick up Grumpy Cat. Alright. I see a big chicken. Don't tell Rachel, but I'm passing up that big giant chicken. Pretty cool. <laughs> he is cool. This is a kind of a oh, it's a candle in there. Mm -hmm. But I learned that these are berry baskets, so you can use this to wash your berries out. Yeah. Oh, that smells. Ooh, smell it guys. Can you smell it right right there through the camera? Oh my gosh, that's that's scrumptious. I kind of do miss candles. Of all the things in, in taking on birds, uh, candles are something I miss the most. What's this little guy? Oh, he's Avon. Little Avon apple creamer. That was very sweet. Oh, and there's the bigger cookie jar. Apple basket. This is super cool. It is signed. Look at that. From the KitchenAid. I can't tell. Before they went to stainless. Quite. That's exactly what these are. V I. It's so, almost looks like Viola. But I'm not sure. Is that for like bamboo? Is it what? You can see where water would kind of sit yeah. through the bottom there. Exactly I'm not sure what you'd put in that, but I'm very, very intrigued. So for $6, I'm going to grab that. Let's see, we've got some giraffes. We've got a giraffe shelf sitter. He would be $8. This little guy is missing a horn. These are plastic. He's plastic. He's wood. He's kind of pretty. But he's kind of big too. So I will leave him. See anything down here? Yeah. All right. Yes. This is just a little single shaker made in Japan. It's party. Oh. Oh, let me come closer. Oh. Let me look at these first. I don't know why I like I I know why I like those. I like them because of the color. 
but they're nothing. They're just nothing. That just lowered it. So, so getting my hands on it, it's it's not depression glass. Um, I think you're right. I think it's like a 1980s mm -hmm. kind of piece. Yeah, I would I would put it at least ten bucks. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty. Well, it's nice. Of, yeah. it fits into a lot of decor. Nice quality. Ooh. Okay, just, just a Look at the yeah. color on that. This is Amberina. I'm not exactly sure what its original purpose was, but I love it. And again, I probably wouldn't pay $12 if I was at Goodwill, but I'll pay $12 here because I know where the money's going. So, so Rebecca, have, our, have, have I ever told you how I feel about these things? I hate them so much. I call them science experiments. Yeah, they are. Why did everybody have these? I don't know. I spy big pieces of fruit. You know what my other weakness is? My big pieces of fruit. These, these need to be priced still. <laughs> they're they're um, they're still like they were above somebody's kitchen. They got that little kitchen shelf grease on them. Which if I buy them, they'll probably get again because that's exactly where they will go. Those look very very Swedish. Wait, is it a Swedish duck? I'm listening. How do, how does a Swedish duck go? Quick, quick. <laughs> Sorry, that was like really bad humor. Sorry, all my Swedish Swedish friends. Ten bucks. We're gonna grab those. This this guy's kind of catching my attention. Oh, he's got a fish. I thought he had a banana at first. I'm like, what you doing with a banana, dude? He's ten bucks. Oh, he's the Red Mill. Red Mill. He is so cute. Did you hear about the big controversy in the fishing tournament? Oh my gosh, it was like a big thing. I watched it on TikTok. These people who had won, this team that had won year after year, mm -hmm. and we're talking big money. We're talking yeah. boats and yeah. equipment. They got caught cheating. They were stuffing the fish with weights, and they got caught, and it's all on video, and it's all over TikTok. It's like this big scandal thing. Only go look if you don't mind some swearing, because there is a lot of swearing going on from all the people standing there who got cheated out of money for years. Crazy. Oh, I think I have to have him. Costa Rica. He is a toucan and he is marvelous and he is six dollars. Oh, those are kind of cute. The little hanging pottery. My fear, uh, anything I hang up like that, we'd have some big windstorm come through and it would be destroyed. I know. Although there's a spider. Oh, come on, that's a bonus. Bonus spider. Where is he? Where's that? Are you seeing things? Because I don't see them. All right. All right. I think you're seeing things. Oh, there is. Wait, wait, what? Oh! Itsy bitsy spider went up the pottery spouts. <laughs> okay. We'll let him be his little spider self in peace. He's a bonus. You get a lucky spider if you buy that. Oh, what are these little foxes down here? Blooming in woodland. Containers. Those are awful cute. I'm looking for a price on one of them. I'm not a big orange fan. I'm not usually attracted to orange. He's got some scratches on him, so I think I'm going to leave them, but they are cute. They are cute. Oh, he's a birdhouse. Oh, he's he's adorable. He's cute. No price, but I'm gonna ask. Oh, they're gonna they're gonna charge you double. <laughs> Thomas Kincaid Santa ornaments. Didn't even know Thomas Kincaid made Santa ornaments. Those were kind of cool. And then the little Thomas Kincaid holiday gathering, little scene box. I'm not a big Thomas Kincaid fan, I must confess. Oh, we got more chickens. More chickens. Don't tell, don't tell Rachel. Don't tell. I just got her another cool chicken the other day, so she's she's gotten her little chicken fix lately. It's all good. Oh wow, look at that one. 
It's Love a gourd. Him. Only six bucks. Six and bucks and he signed. Yeah. See, That's now you now cool. you feel like I feel shopping at a thrift store. <laughs> oh, oh, gourd. Oh, gourd. Yeah. Oh, gourd. Leslie. Grandpa's bar. These look old. That's pretty cool. Six beverage coasters. Notice. Oh yeah, 1993. I was gonna say notice there's no barcode, but there is a barcode. I, I these are cute. Like new old stock is what that's called. Mm -hmm. 1993 for two bucks. All right, I'm gonna get Grandpa's coasters. That's interesting. That who is, is who is he? Um, that's a god. Yeah, he's some. He brass. Ooh. He's from Pacific Giftware. He is interesting. No. Oh, look at these little guys. I don't think it's big enough for any bird to really use, though. Birdies need more room, like, like this little condo here. It doesn't have a hanger, though. Darn it. All right. Are you not going to get the gourd? You don't want the gourd? If you don't want the gourd, I want the gourd. I'm, 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 oh, I'm taking the gourd. Look who I found at my store. <laughs> At your store? <laughs> no, this is cool. Did you did you see these? All these Kincaids? Yes, those are amazing. Somebody had quite a, and it was probably one of those things you had to order one at a time over months and months. Isn't that cute? Oh, he's cute. Oh, he's really cute. It looked like when I came in, I had to scrub the heck out of it, but I thought. Yeah. Yeah. Just gotta find. I, I imagine like any kind of like a piggy bank stopper would go in there. Okay, I'm grab. I'm grabbing him. We're making you lots of new room. <laughs> oh, birds! I see birds. You know, my whole Christmas tree is done in birds. Oh, I didn't know. The entire tree. Yes. All right. Ooh, 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 rubber ducky, you're the one. You know, I, got, I, I have this flamingo in my pool, and he needs a friend. What better than a ride-on duck? What is this little guy? Yeah. They're trying to, trying to dress me. Hold on, let me come look. What do you guys think? Now, you need a gold belt, you need holy jeans. I could just wear black jeans. No. No? And a white t-shirt. Low cut. Low cut. <laughs> you, I, I like you to be in style. <laughs> what do you think? There's a gold tennis shoe. I think so. She's gold tennis shoes, too. Let's check them out. Oh, let's, wait, 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 wait. The hat, the hat. Oh, yeah, look at by the way, the, the dog in the background is my sweet Darth. Oh, look at these guys. Look oh at these. Oh my God, I would die. Look at those. Oh my gosh. You could be a pimp. Look at that. I'm a thrift pimp. There you go. <laughs> the hat kind of fits. You know, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. And then we got size 8. Yeah, over there. I'm helping somebody. Eight and a half. Oh, that's doable. Eight and a half. We need a ten. It's so funny because the sign is still on the hat that says, "Please do not remove." Oh, oh, it's even small. So, I need a bigger foot. So, even small. Oh, no, they do look kind of small. I'm gonna do that. Try them on. You never yeah, know. I could probably get away with that. They're a little big, but once they put a sock on, you know. But the sock can't show. Yeah, you need a, a hideaway sock. Sock can't show though. Sock can't show. make that happen. And I see, I spy, I spy a real pimp. Oh gosh. 
Now she's the pimp. <laughs> okay, we'll have to see. I'm gonna see. Maybe. It's a maybe. It's a maybe. I don't know if I'm brave enough. I gotta be honest. I don't know if I'm brave enough to wear that and go down Fremont Street <laughs> wearing that. It's not really what I do, but maybe, maybe. They do get the cutest purses here, I gotta say. That's the sack. It's that really nice, soft but heavy leather. Look at this cute little boho guy. Oh, cute little frilly purse. It's 20. Oh, that is like so 90s. So, so 90s on that one. Hmm. I don't know. I just, I have to really be in the mood to shop purses. Because I'm not a purse girl and they don't really call to me. And I'm like, ah, sometimes I just go, I don't know. I don't know. If it calls to me and says, buy me, buy me, it's easier than like, like looking them up and trying to figure out which ones are good. But there are, there are some interesting purses here for sure. For sure. Look at all these really cute doggy bowls. Oh. Look at the hedgehog one. It's a hedgehog doggy bowl. We don't use doggy bowls. Oh, they got one of those auto feeders here too. We just got one of those for Ozzy. Well, because Ozzy does not self-regulate his eating. <laughs> so we have to do it for him. See what we got in the Oh, that is a really nice pack. Really nice pack. We got a larger dog for exercise. Have them carry stuff for you. Oh, they got a couple of them. Nice outward hound. Cool, cool. Little carrier. Oh, that's a cute little carrier. Mm, doesn't close up all the way. I'm kind of looking for another one for Bougie for taking him back and forth to my office. He's been chewing on the plastic of the one I got him in. I see a sock monkey. He's a sock monkey with a tag. If you ever find the sock monkeys that are handmade back from the days before they commercially made them, those are worth some big bucks. Nope, no toys for us today. Oh, let's see what we got in the little special case. That's a really cool piece right there. Some nice buckles. We got some spun glass. Oh, that's a really cute little ladybug. It might be Swarovski. We got some hat pins. Mickey Mouse watches. That looks like a large Coco Joe. Yeah, a little doggy. They get really, really nice jewelry here. <gasps> Look at the horse heads. Oh, he's so pretty. So pretty. Oh, those are cute. Those are really cute. Select strands. This is carrots and and peas. Carrots and peas. Yeah. Mine are peas and carrots. <laughs> Pears and grapes and oh, you, oh, look at the hamburgers. Oh, those are so and hot dogs and and tomatoes and oh, those are so cute. Corn in the corn. Those are really cute. How much are they? Eight dollars each. So these are we sell these are glass beads yeah is it a bead i'm looking for i'm looking around where do you string it where do you string them oh oh there i see it i see it so is that is that a bat oh yeah they're beads are they all are they three dollars each or is just that one three dollars each Anything like that. I would say they're $3. Oh gosh, look at the fish. 
Look at cuties! All right, all right. We're gonna get a few of these. Let's see what else we got. Yeah, what's going on in there? What's going on in there? These are just little little round beads. Oh. Look at this one. Oh, that's fantastic. Right. Oh, look at the little Santa Claus. Okay. Oh, are they little? Oh, they are so cute. Is it the whole package of them then? Or like what? what's the pricing then? Um... So I'm going to get all those, too. <laughs> She's saying, no, not the mug. Not the mug. That's the first thing I'm looking at. No, I actually want to look at Bugs Bunny first. Collector's Guild. Charter member. Figurine. Then we got Goofy. He's one of those Walt Disney collector clubs. You know, like Snow White. We have to talk. I have to get to the mugs. How much are the mugs? Uh, the other one has a price on it. What's that? This one's 12. Okay. This one. Oh, how Eight. cool is that? Besides All the... chalky, though. Yeah. It's a little more than I can do on mugs. Mm -hmm. Somebody will, though. Yeah. It's a great collector price. Okay, you can have your mug back, Snow White. Who's he? The Who's prince? this guy? Oh, he's the prince. Oh, All no, right. he's not. No, he doesn't look like a prince. He looks like Prince from Snow White. Oh, he's so. the prince. Oh, and there she is. Well, hello there. Someday my prince will come. Right. And, oh, there's Pooh on the shelf. Uh-oh. Pooh on the shelf. Lots of poo. Love it. <laughs> Okay, free bird! Free bird! <laughs>
that was a fun and fantastic shopping trip at Dog Junkies. So if you are in the Las Vegas area, please do come by and support Dog Junkies, which is the thrift store that supports the nonprofit A Home 4 Spot. That's A Home, the number four spot, which you guys have always done so amazingly in the past. Um, when I was shopping here more regularly. It's at 4324. It's North Decatur, right? Yep. North Decatur. All right. With that, we're going to head home and do some more planning on this building and yep. get things going and all that goes into that. I know it's so much. It's so much. <laughs> all right. You go be profitable and make it fun. Oh, she's got it down. Thank you.